Third and final pose I'm going to be hitting is going to be the side chest. When you put your foot in the middle of your foot, uh, your one foot in the middle of the other foot, you want to make sure you're dragging this hamstring across this leg. So this leg is actually pushing out the back hamstring, allowing it to hang and look bigger than it is. And in the upper body, personally, I like to kind of vacuum. It allows me to stick my chest up. But regardless, you want to make sure your chest is up to look as big as possible. And you don't want to have any gaps. Also, as you're turning, with his back chest, you can see this is fully flexed. I'm taking this shoulder and I'm shoving into this pec just to bring out all the striations in this chest. From there, second pec, you wanna lift it up as high as possible, drag that shoulder back, and again, rotate your body as much as possible so you look wide as possible on the top, small waist again, and then the big hamstring up. Specific, I want nothing less than terrific. I know y'all get it, I'm a 